And Beecham, we referenced her number 35 for Ohio State. Their minutes will pick up in the absence of those three players, and Beecham gets another bucket. Nice awareness by Peebles, short corner. Crossover, Sheldon, beautiful pass to Patty. She knows what to do with that. The Buckeyes with the nice post pass from Sheldon. Through their actions, how much they enjoy being with each other. Poole, the five-star recruit with the dish off to Green, and look at the bench for Ohio State. They love it. And they are 0 for 2 to start here in the third quarter as they find Hutcherson down low for the easy two. Game. Well, it's happening now in the third quarter. Check out number two in red, just hunting down low, finding... Eight zip Nebraska run to extend Nebraska's lead to eight, which is the largest in the game, and the Buckeyes answer down low with Patty. She'll make up for it. Checking for the Buckeyes, number four. Jason Look at the spacing for Ohio, or for Nebraska, rather. Kane keeps the ball nice and high, sneaks in the backside. Look, you don't see any red jerseys even close to her. Everyone has their back to Kane. Kane came into this game averaging eight per for the Huskers. 15 here tonight. That shot is off. Saved back in. Right into Juhas who put it off glass. The last game against Wisconsin. Gabby Nolan's got the hot hand. Have to have a hand up in her face the moment she gets the ball. Lots of three looks this time. J.C. Sheldon knocks down for her first points. Still can hit. And then on the other end, Buckeyes can show off a little bit from beyond the arc as well. We've got a clip trying to make that a harder layup for Nas Helma when she gets positioned. She's got six points in this game that actually matches her point ah. total from the last game against Wisconsin. Nikola Shikova with a tough angle and a tough shot. Ten point advantage, largest lead of the game. Double team coming for Nas Hillman. She's in trouble and throws it away. Ohio State's done a nice job getting the ball up in transition for those lay-ins as Sheldon finishes. As effective, the double comes from Juhas, Mikola Shikova. Green comes over into that passing lane to get the steal, getting up, making buckets in transition. Mikola Shikova drops it off for Beach and beautifully done with that time. Impact in this game off the bench for Ohio State. How about the passing? Just like a guard for the Ohio State bucket. Picked up the dribble in uh, one of those spots. You cannot do it. And they are lucky to get away without giving up the bucket. Sheldon filling a lane and laying it in. Diamond Miller has to come alive for Maryland on the road. She scores the first bucket of the second half. She's a player that averages 18 points a game, and she did not score much in the first half. Most of the season for a team that's only averaging 10 turnovers a game, and it leads to an easy basket underneath for Aaliyah Patty. For Northwestern was to contain the painted area. Long ball is no good for Northwestern. How much do you think we'll see this zone from Northwestern when they can, which an opportunity like that from Braxton Miller is not going to allow them to set it up? Yeah, I had that with, with my kids, and I don't know. I had to have that whistle on hand. And Sheldon has found her mark here tonight, all nine points. J.C. Sheldon right here in transition. She's just going to pull it. Catch from three for Iowa. So neither one of these teams connecting from deep yet. Patty will take for the old-fashioned three-point play down inside. For rim runs in transition, here comes Patty running right in front of the rim. No one established up the line. You know, for, for most of her career, since she's picked up a basketball, teams have relied on her to basically do that. Everything as Patty goes inside for two. Nine point advantage. Juhas feeding Patty for two. 
post to post passing at its best. Sometimes it's just the high post dumping it down. Dorka Juhas can put it on the deck, draw defenders. Paddle to rather Smith will turn the corner for Minnesota, go to the rim and block by Juhas. Here's Ohio State the other way. Miller with an outlet ahead for Sheldon, running the left lane line and she lays it in. Sheldon, 18 point lead, their largest, 6.45 to play in the third, and here's another steal. Sheldon for the Buckeyes, three on two, down the left lane line, bounce past Patty, who laid it in right of the rim. Gives Wisconsin a two-point lead, Buckeyes ball. Juhas in the corner, throws it inside. Here's a spin by Beecham, and it's in. Sheldon, Ohio State, stops above the top of the zone. Left wing for Juhas, she'll angle to the paint, dush it off. Patty caught it and goes to her right and lays it in right of the rim. More right wing, quick trigger, long three, no. Patty the Buckeye board, give it for Miller, throw a long pass, Sheldon caught it and laid it in right of the rim and a bucket and a foul called late on the Sheldon lay and she got pushed from behind by Janelle Grant. Poole at the top, bounces it away for Miller, hands it back for Poole. Poole to drive down the left lane line, dish it off for Rebecca who puts it up and in. Poole to Mikolashikova for the lay in. Gonna be a little pick and roll, lobs it underneath for Kyle, caught it and then lost it. Stolen by Ohio State, it's Poole taking it away. Her no look pass, zipped ahead to Patty who laid it in, dime from Poole. If I can get the stat monitor to work, has been, uh, well, the largest lead for Ohio State, 17. They're currently, here's another Buckeye steal. Sheldon in for the right, hooks a pass back for you, Hosser laid it in, low right. Miss shot and the rebound of Ohio State's Kinsiri Poole. Oh, a crossover dribble to down the line and pass. passes for Juhas. Pull the dime for Juhas who laid it in and will get another timeout. An important okay. start, too, for, for Michigan. They wanted to get off to a good offensive start, Roy. No doubt. Ohio State known for its this offense is, uh, under, head, under head coach Kevin McGuff. Must have heard me saying something about him. <laughs> Come on. Like, no, right? <laughs> Connolly with a huge game for the Bulldogs. She had 24, and then they held Tennessee. And Brooke Weisbrod has shown up. They haven't exactly I played their know. best basketball. I don't know. I'm, you don't want to put you in that boat, too. Don't, don't, don't be trying <laughs> to put me out there with just one oar. They need a three. I think Sheldon's the one to find it. Uh-oh. Good look inside a six-point game. And it's been the young players today. Poole, this time Miller, passes it inside. Still on the ball, underhand oh. pass to Aaliyah Patty, plus one. Crafty handoff. He tossing off to Patty, a little change of speed. Draws two white jerseys. But unfortunately, this year her consecutive game streak came to an end. She missed a couple with a shoulder injury, but back on the floor. What a pass from Poole. That's been a great tandem. A couple of possessions in a row now for Ohio State. Significantly impacting this game from a scoring standpoint. Look at her fighting for position down low on your screen in the paint, 32. and. As a former coach, I love it. Every head coach out there would love to have somebody like Matt on their team. I just love the nicknames. You got T-Baby, you got Zippy. See the run currently for Rutgers. Garante's off the mark there. Buckeyes having some success inside. Aaliyah Patty with a chance for three. In transition defense by Rutgers, and Ohio State makes them pay. Patty.